Ever wondered what secrets an ancient city nestled between the peaks of the Himalayas might hold? A place where every corner tells a story, every scent has a history, and every face has seen a lifetime. Welcome to a city that defies time. Welcome to Kathmandu, Nepal. Greetings, fellow explorers. If you've ever thought about taking the road less traveled and diving into a cultural experience like no other, you've clicked on the right video. Today, we're venturing through the heart and soul of Nepal's capital, Kathmandu, and I promise by the end of this journey, you'll be yearning to wander its ancient streets yourself. Let's embark on this adventure together and explore the top must-do things in Kathmandu. First on our list is the historical Kathmandu Durbar Square, a marvel of Nuwari architecture. This area was once the epicenter of Nepal's royalty. Every building here has a story. From the Taleju Temple soaring into the sky to the intricately carved wooden windows of the old royal palace, this square isn't just a collection of buildings, it's the living heart of Kathmandu, echoing centuries of history. Here you can witness the remnants of the Mala King's legacy and the Shah dynasty that followed. Marvel at the craftsmanship of the stone artisans seen in the statues of gods and goddesses and walk through the courtyards where kings were once crowned. And if you time your visit right, you might just catch a glimpse of the Kumari, the living goddess, as she blesses onlookers from her ornate wooden balcony. Our second stop takes us to the banks of the Holy Bagmati River at the sacred Pashupatinath Temple. This sprawling temple complex is a place of pilgrimage for Hindus all over the world. As you traverse its stone steps, you'll feel the weight of devotion in the air, from the sadhus draped in saffron, meditating in quiet corners, to the elaborate arti ceremonies at dusk. The air is thick with incense and the reverberations of temple bells. Perhaps the most moving experience here is observing the open-air cremation ceremonies, a profound testament to the Hindu belief in the soul's journey after death. It's a place that invites reflection on the transient nature of life. Number three, and we shift gears to the vibrant and ever-pulsating streets of Tamil. This is the tourist heart of Kathmandu, brimming with energy and color. It's where travelers come together, swapping stories over steaming cups of Nepali tea. Tamil's streets are a maze of shops, selling everything from intricate thanka paintings to hand-knitted yak wool sweaters. As the sun sets, Tamil transforms. Music fills the air from every corner. Cafes and bars spring to life, welcoming you to experience Nepal's vibrant nightlife. Whether you're looking to relax after a day of sightseeing or eager to bargain for the perfect souvenir, Tamil is the place to be. For number four, we venture just north of Kathmandu to the Shivapuri Nagarjun National Park. This protected area is a haven for nature and wildlife enthusiasts. With several hiking trails ranging from leisurely walks to more challenging treks, the park is a refreshing break from the city hustle, home to over 300 species of birds, numerous orchids, and even the occasional leopard, Shivapuri is a biodiversity hotspot. Stand on its high ridges and you'll be rewarded with panoramic views of the Kathmandu Valley below with the snow-capped peaks of the Himalayas as a distant backdrop. Number five brings us back into the heart of local life with a Nepali cooking class. Gather around as a local chef shares the secrets of Nepali cuisine, guiding you in crafting the perfect plate of dalbat, along with a selection of scrumptious side dishes. Perfect your momo pleating technique, discover the art of making the perfect chai, and take these recipes home to impress friends and family with authentic Nepalese flavors. Number six is an experience for the dreamers and the adventurers, a scenic mountain flight that offers a bird's eye view of the Himalayas. Feel the thrill of soaring past some of the world's highest peaks, including the mighty Everest, Amadablam, and Lhotse. It's an unforgettable journey into the heavens that will etch the grandeur of the Nepalese landscape into your memory forever. And speaking of unforgettable, number seven is the trek to Nagarkot. Positioned on the rim of the Kathmandu Valley, Nagarkot is famous for its sunrise and sunset views over the Himalayas. To watch the first or last rays of the sun kiss the mountaintops is to witness the daily awakening or settling of the gods. 
The list goes on with serene spots like the Budanath Stupa, a giant mandala of peace and prayer, Patan and Bhaktapur, cities that rival Kathmandu in their historical and architectural grandeur, the Garden of Dreams, a neoclassical haven, the World Peace Pagoda, an emblem of serenity, and the National Museum of Nepal, a treasure trove of the nation's past. In Kathmandu, the spiritual and the sensory amalgamate into an experience that touches your soul. It's a place where ancient wisdom whispers through the chimes and carvings, and the future hums with the potential of its people. Whether you're here to explore, to learn, or simply to be, Kathmandu opens its arms to you. So let's revisit our journey, exploring ancient Durbar squares, delving into spiritual Pashupatanath, embracing the vibrancy of Tamil, reconnecting with nature in Shivapuri, mastering the art of Nepali cooking, marveling at the Himalayas from above, and witnessing the ethereal beauty of Nagarkot's sunrise. Not to forget the stirring beauty of Budanath, the historical depth of Patan, the medieval charm of Paktapur, the escapism in the Garden of Dreams, the inspiring World Peace Pagoda, the historical wealth of the National Museum, and the sheer exhilaration of trekking through Nepal's natural splendor. As we conclude this chapter of our adventure, remember that Kathmandu is more than just a destination. It's a feeling, one that stays with you long after you've departed its mountains. It's the smiles of the people, the taste of the food, and the scent of the temples. It's an adventure ready to be lived by you. If you've enjoyed this journey as much as I have, please show your support by liking this video and sharing it with your fellow adventurers. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more travel inspiration and stories from around the globe. Until our paths cross again in another adventure, namaste and happy travels.